You gotta move on and live your life. Find your destiny. All right, here we go, part two. Calico! Oh man, you were talking in your sleep, weirdo. <laughs> Poor nightmares. Okay. Mantis, join the crew. We I'm assuming this is where we'll make our own lightsaber, because that looks like a lightsaber station. That's where we sleep. That is homie. What's that? Interact. Oh, it's a guitar. What the? and witness events connected to it. You feel its history. It's an echo in the force oh. of the object. Not many Jedi have that skill. How would you know that? I was once a Jedi, but not anymore. Do I know you? No, but I knew your master, Jaro Tapal. He was a true guardian of the Republic was a hero. Jaro. Listen. Why? Jaro. Something happened to me during the purge. I survived, but I love how they call my it the connection purge. to the force is damaged. Order when I 66. meditate, if I let my guard down, I lose control. And it's like I'm back in that moment when you survived, Cal. Yo, what up, living legend? How you doing, man? And you're not alone. Not anymore. We'll come up on our destination. He has very big, uh, very big eyes and small, like, pupils. You can literally see all the whites of her eyes. That's dope. <laughs> Bogano. Just, just got this game downloading it now. Nice, dude. Dude. You're in for a treat. I'm only like 40 minutes into the game. So you won't find it on any maps. I'm not too far on the like doesn't know this place exists. No. Nothing nothing too special has happened other than meeting her. Hide out here. We're done hiding, Cal. See that structure over there? I believe that vault holds the key to rebuilding the Jedi Order. But it requires someone strong in the force to pass its test. And since you're not a Jedi anymore, that's why you need me. I know you don't trust me. And I'm not really sure I trust you. But we have a common enemy. And a common cause. It's a start. I'll share more of my plan after you reach the vault. But, until then, there's someone here I think you should meet. May the Force be with you. And also with you. <laughs> This game is beautiful so far, man. All right. I don't know what that was. This is looking for a Jedi then. But if there's already one here, skill point acquired. Me. Look at these little guys. Okay. Ah. Uh... There it is. Now, I don't know shit about Star Wars. Never seen a movie, but the game looks great to me. Oh my god, dude. Well, there's plenty of people that have never seen the movies, but I personally really like all the movies. I've been wanting to rewatch three and then go through and watch all the, the rest of them afterwards. They're all amazing. And the game so far... It's a lot of fun too. 
Okay, so spend your skill point. I guess we're spending it on overhead slash. Unlocks a powerful strike that is deadly against weak enemies. Press Y. Oh, sweet. Uh, actually, should I look at the? Yeah, I'll look at it. Let's look at the skill tree. So what can we unlock later on? It looks like there's more abilities we'll be able to unlock too. But we can't really see them right now. I'm assuming like the uh, gray areas with nothing in it is an area that uh, will unlock a new ability once you get some of the other ones. So anyways, uh, dash strike. So left is force, middle is lightsaber, and right is survival. That's maximum health, or superior blocking, allowing him to take uh, take less stamina or damage from in incoming attacks. Leaping slash, dash strike, evasive kick, sprint strike. Hey, right? Sprint strike. Okay. Yep. Uh, empowered slow. You can s slow people longer, and then you get maximum force increased. Okay. Sweet. So it's a very basic um, skill points. There's no level or anything like that, but the more you, uh, more enemies and things, I assume hey, you get more XP. BD1. And then I'm Cal. eventually there's like a cap where you get a new uh, skill point. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm just I'm looking for someone. No, <laughs> not you. I'm searching for a, a How do Jedi, they talk to I think. Hold on. You know the Jedi? What do you know? Wait, hold on. Or is it just like... like... Thanks. Whoa. What the... Oh. Left side. That's the Vault Seer mentioned. So my friend, I've never seen any movie. He literally yelled at me and said, we're starting on the movies Monday, so it looks like week's plan. Dude, that's awesome. That's great, too. Um, they're all, I mean, each one has like their ups and downs. Personally, my favorite is episode three, which is the one that this game takes place right after. Um, three is a prequel. Experiment with the hollow map controls. That's cool. Um, but all the new ones are really good too. I, I think a lot of people don't really like some of the newer ones, but I, I like anything Star Wars, so I'm not super picky, honestly. Also, customization. Oh, sweet. Yo, look at all that. There's a lot right there. So we have this jacket right now, and it looks like we're going to get a bunch more outfits, too. This is the outfit we had from the last mission. I'll hold on to what I have. Uh, BD-1. So this is the droid. Premium content. I think we're going to do the red. Mantis. Yeah, red once again. Gold squadron. Okay. Oh, wait, wait. How do you open the map? It is busy. Also, Disney Plus, dude, Disney Plus is a perfect place to watch all Disney the Plus movies, too, somehow. because they're all in 4K. You know how much buying that your it itself is, like, 200-something dollars, buying, like, the Blu-ray 4K HD, you know if not more work? than that. So, Disney Plus has all the Star Wars movies in 4K, or upscaled to 4K, which is amazing. And I can't wait to watch it now. Because I have the regular Blu-ray edition, Careful over but there. now since see. that's out, hopefully sometime Back soon I'll be able to watch them. Also, Rogue One, great movie. Hold on, I'm coming. What button pulls out the lightsaber? X. Uh, that was a question to me too. Uh, yeah, I got you. Whoa. Yeah, so when you, like, basic it attacks or I think if you aim on somebody it also pulls out the lightsaber okay. so some of these break oh. 
Ooh, there's something in here. Sense echo. Whoever lived here used this room for storage. They kept food and supplies. Oh. A larder. Oh. Blue objects you have to slow down. Hey, that was pretty brave. You okay? I didn't even see him. Wait. Aw. It's I hurt. Help you with that. Oh. Will you let me? Yeah, let me help you out, little guy. Oh. <laughs> okay. It's cute. It honestly is a little wally. Well, <laughs> your scomp link is busted, but this should help you get moving for now. It's cute. Okay, let's try that. Really like the sound when you swing the lightsaber? Yeah. Definitely, uh, the audio and everything is on point. The Sounds ball. very good. Yeah, that's where I was headed too. Well, Deep trill. <laughs> first, we gotta figure out a way out of this place. Is there anything inside here? Right here that I can take? Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. What? So we can choose the color. So there's blue, green, and orange. I'm gonna try orange. The emitter. Okay. That one looks pretty cool. Uh, so that's Jaro to Paul. And looks like you'll eventually unlock more. So I'm going to change it to... Jeez, this thing is beat up. I'm going to change it to the Umbarian. Switch. Uh, Let's go Umbarian again. Yeah, look at... Oh my gosh, that thing is so beat up. Like, literally the end of it is falling off. Let's do that. Alloy. Okay, so now you can change the... Yeah, let's do that. That's beautiful. And orange, I feel like that, that goes perfect with him. And that's not just because he has orange hair. Uh, BD, <laughs> that's a little small for me. Don't worry. I'll I do prefer red lightsabers. Tight fit, but this should work. I feel like this is gonna make me want to go back and play uh, Swotor, because they did heck come out with the new expansion too. Those vines look like they lead somewhere. Hope they're sturdy. Uh, hold left bumper to illuminate with your lightsaber. Oh, sick. I think someone said the little guy is with you throughout the rest of the game. Yep, he is. Um, he's in, if you watch like any of the trailers, he's pretty much like on your back the entire game. So I'm assuming we'll become best buds and then he'll be with us going forward. Oh, ouch. Okay. I feel like we should have known that, but <laughs> yeah, I'm all right. Oops. Oh, nice. So this is how we learn how to heal. What does he give him? Stem. You're full of surprises. <clears throat> That's better. Thanks Get ready joy. to stab yourself a lot, Cal. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, uh, He's pulling on her leg. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Here, hop on board. All right, boy. Oh, nice! It stopped. So, Chris, how'd you get here? Her blemish stem canisters. Don't remember? Multiple entries. I've never known a forgetful droid. Can't argue with that. Uh, wait, wait. I feel like I'm gonna miss something if I don't go this way. Hey, a chest. Oh, a Jedi chest. Mind if we grab supplies? <laughs> Okay, well, now we know what chests look like. A uh, new emitter acquired, and you know, Cordova. Okay, so it's a lightsaber customization. That's where Change we lightsaber need to go. workbench throughout the galaxy on Mantis. Anything right here? It's pretty linear, 
but it seems really like there's bug. a good amount of uh, objects and special stuff you can find. Jeez. Oh, God. Ah, okay. Chill, chill. And there is dismemberment, but it looks like it's for animals only. I don't really think, unless if it's like pre-scripted, I don't think there's any dismemberment for humans. Nice. And at that, uh, at the moment, the robot was thinking, stupid human. <laughs> All right. Great divide. Whoa. Oh? They're giant statues. You mapped everywhere we've been. Oh, sick. So, how do you read this? I'm confused. Switch elevations. So, oh, okay, I'm right there. And then in order to get here, there's that. There's a door right there. What is the... Interesting. I can't make it over there. We gotta find another way. We're going to find a way to the chasm. I mean, there's one right here. Unless if... Can we... No! No, not that way. <laughs> okay. That looks like you could jump up and, and grab onto that. The way that's set up. Oh, God. It looks like you can, but I guess not. Okay. Well, luckily there's a ton of these everywhere. But maybe. Oh, God. Elevators can't be called on this side right now. Oh, no. What just happened? Try that again. Okay. Oh. Rest to restore life and force. Resting is not required. Uh, oh, it's not required to save your progress. Resting will respawn enemies. Oh man, that's the same as uh, like Dark Souls and things like that. And then, um, and Remnant. Forgot about that aspect, I guess. One sec. Okay, we're good now. Do I climb this thing? The tool was used by someone okay. eager to reach the vault. Traveling to the vault. A tool used by a traveler who wanted to dot dot dot. Um, hold up, let me... Is resting as a completely separate option? Oh yeah, it is. If you press X. Or en enemies have respawned, okay. So you can go to one of these, up, update your stuff, and not, uh, I, sorry, distraction. Uh, you can you not rest if you don't want to. So what was in there? Which is cool. New poncho. Ooh. I like that. I don't really like the color, but. Cool. You can change your poncho in the pause menu. Oh, and we're back where we started at. I guess let's try going to this side. Oh no, oh no, oh no. There's a ton of stuff down there too. Wait, so. We're not supposed to go this way, right? I mean, it doesn't look like we're supposed to. Ooh. 
let's try... So we pull up the map. So I can drop down there. Oh wait, is that right here? Yes, it is. Okay. And then we can jump this way. And that. And then maybe... Aha! Can we do an execute? Yes! Nice. Oh god. Run for it! Nice. Okay. Oh no. How is this little thing? Oh god. That was close. Oh yeah, I have this Y ability now too, I forgot. Do we... Uh, scan. Find something? If it highlights, highlights red like that, what does that mean? Oh! Oh god. Oh no. Ah! Ah! Maybe he has a piece. Ew. <laughs> it just dies to its tongue out like that. I honestly can't wait to go to the other planets and, and just explore. It's gonna be so much cool stuff to see. Subterranean refuge. We won't rest, just in case. Yes. Skill point acquire. Thank you very much. I'm thinking about enabling the ability where it automatically, um, don't targets the enemies when you enter combat because I feel like sometimes the camera is like facing a different way uh oh what do I hear what'd you find I'll check it out nice job so when he jumps off your back that usually See means something he found there? something. What is that? Oh, it's that giant thing up there. Sick. Try again. Whoa. It's difficult, Master. Yes, the path is difficult. It may seem impossible, but Damn. with persistence <laughs> and the force as your ally, you I gotta say his face looks a lot older than his you actual body. <laughs> now, but I see what they're trying to, to do. What? Run, jump. Holy crap! That's sick. Ah. Try again. Trust yourself. Yes, master. Yes, master. Again. Okay. Faster. More intense. Ah. Uh, Reach my okay. position. Ah. I did it. Oh, nice. The force is my ally. Just remembering old tricks. Sweet. Holy moly. The chat just went off like crazy. So <laughs> think you can show me that shortcut again?
Where is that? Where are we? I keep losing us. Oh. We're on this level down here, and then if we get to that, I think it will take us all the way up there. Okay. Is it this way? Are you uploading Star Wars to YouTube? Ups, absolutely. Absolutely. And I bet you now we can enter that other area because now we can uh, fall from. I'm actually making some uh, stream markers for when I'll like change up the uh, or when I'm gonna like cut the videos on YouTube so that way it's a little bit more better organized and it doesn't end like during a game or something like that because <laughs> right now my my editing for YouTube is is not the greatest it's because I do it in such short spans but if I start using like stream markers things like that it'll make it a lot better and easier also I wanted to watch it begin uh, to the begin because Wi-Fi is bad here hey man I you get it it's a it's a good amount too so uh i think to be safe i'm gonna go with the extra health for now because you can never go wrong with extra health and then the next ability i get i'll probably get the force okay nice so This makes traversal so much easier now. Here's a chest. Hey now. It's gonna be a lightsaber part. Switch acquired. Nice. Can we turn this on? Hey BD1. Hi BD1. Doesn't look like it. Oh, I thought you could walk on that. Whoops. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh man. What the? What? What did I do? Did I break it? Oh, interact. Oh, sweet. Oh, I walked forward. It went, it went up. Okay, I see, I see. Now, I think we can, yep, we can wall run over there. So, we need to get back up top. Oh, no. Oh, oh whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Whoops. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Chill, chill. Chill with that chomper. Whew. Huh? Okay. Uh, do you already have a lightsaber or do you, uh, do you get to make one? So you start with one, but you get to customize it like pretty early on. So like literally like, um, when I got to this area, I found a workstation. And then once I, uh, walked over to it, I was able to customize my uh, lightsaber and from like pre-order. Well, I never pre-ordered the game, but I have uh, EA Premiere or Origin access. So I, I have a few, uh, you start with a few customizations for like your ship and your other stuff. So. Pretty Must be repaired to operate this device. Holding up okay? Like there, I just found a lightsaber sleeve. But like, you start out with a, I think it's blue. I did change this one. So it's a different, uh, the switch, everything on my lightsaber there is, is changed from original. Uh, the, the end piece, the middle piece, the material, and then also the uh, the color, I changed it to orange. You you have blue, orange, and green, but.
but orange I believe is the uh, special edition or like deluxe or by having like pre-ordered it or something like that same thing with your ship like you can pretty much do that all from the beginning Right here, customization. You can change outfits that you find. I found this one in a chest. Of course, all these are other ones. Um, here's BD1. There's his default. Here's the Crimson, Vanguard, and Premium. B. <laughs> I see what they did. BD1. <laughs> Instead of just BD1. And then Gold Squadron. Crimson, and then you have more that will unlock, I assume. Can I look at my lightsaber? Okay, so these are your, like, basic attacks. Data bank. Quests. We're on chapter one. It does tell you... Okay, so 38% explored. There's... I don't know what those stars are. What is that? Is there a, a thing that tells you? So I'm assuming we'll eventually get to a planet map and we'll have a bunch of other planets we can look at too. But right now this is the first one we technically traveled to. Racy there. Ancient Vault. Oh, <laughs> it's on. BD one's cute. We're not oh, finished man. yet. Oh man. Okay, okay, he probably would have won. Okay. Probably. Let's meditate first. Let's rest. Okay. These objects, he has like a force, a connection with the force where if something's glowing like that, if he touches it, he can like understand what it is or like who's been there. Like, he has a connection to objects. Sweet. It's promising. Yeah, let's just climb through this random dark hole that we've never seen Amazing. before. Scan. I bet you it's going to be a map. This seems like an area to have a map. Well done, whoever you are. You have passed the test I left You know, Cordova. And gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I am Master Eno Cordova. I may not know your name, Eno but Cordova. I know your purpose. The fate of the Jedi Order lies in your hands. This place this vault is a sacred temple built by a vanished civilization known as the zephyr meditating here i was granted a premonition through the force a vision of doom i have placed inside this vault a jedi holocron containing a list of the names and locations of young force sensitives throughout the galaxy Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but ah. also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages and learn to perceive the mysteries of the Force as the Zephyr once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Go to the Zephyr homeworld. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Good luck, Jedi. And may the Force be with you. So, I was partially kind of right. What? <laughs> He's like... I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. What? We have well, a purpose. I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. There's no way to live. 
Not for a Jedi. Or a droid. Maybe Seer was right. Maybe we're done hiding. We rise. Hey. You want to meet the someone, rise uh, of Skywalker? Friends of mine. <laughs> All right, let's go uh, introduce our little buddy. Discover the Bogano Vault. I'm assuming these other areas will open up eventually or something, or we'll probably be making a trip back here a few times. Oh, wait, uh, wait. Use the hollow table on the Mantis. Is the Mantis our ship? I think so, yeah. I think I found what you wanted me to see. Whee! Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. Bring it on, big guy. Let's do it. Big frog. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, God. I forgot about that. I keep tapping X, but we have a Y ability now, which apparently does a good amount of damage. I'm currently playing on uh, Jedi Knight difficulty, which is the standard, like that's your normal difficulty. Um, so far, it doesn't seem okay, too no. bad. I think I'm capable of doing it. <laughs> so I don't, I don't know if I'm going to switch to story mode. If I get to a point where I'm like struggling to the point where I constantly die and I'm annoyed, then I'll switch to story mode. But for now, I'm, I'm okay with, with this difficulty. It gives you ample enough uh, parry time. And with story mode, it's literally like nothing but 100% parry time and then no damage taken. Almost no damage. My friend, it appears the Sefo had some interest in Dathomir. Dathomir. Strange. Good old uh, Darth Maul. Darth Maul. Any sort of fascination area. with a place so dark. I can't wait to watch uh, the Clone War, Clone Wars movie, and then the uh, TV show as well on Disney Plus. There's also a list out there nice that like has every single like important hey, episode, but uh, I think I'm just honestly going to watch the entire thing for all the seasons. Uh, yeah, we'll make the enemies respawn. Should be a lot quicker than the way in. So. We want to take this guy there. I think it is this guy. Oh, oh no. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Can I not take that? What? ED, please. It's so satisfying learning new abilities and then uh, putting them to use like already. Just makes things easier. Okay. Yeah. We're oh no! Oh, I did not mean to get down here, but you know what? I'll take that. Oh god, BD. Am I dead? I think I am. When you die, you lose all your XP gains since your last skill point. Damaging the enemy who killed you will restore your lost XP and refill your life and force to its maximum. What the? Holy, dude, that thing just like one one shot or one hit killed me. No, it's not one shot. Seeing all the Clone Wars TV show, my favorite episode, uh, show these young Jedi kids making their own lightsaber. Really? Yeah, I haven't watched any of those. I didn't know that they are like crucial at all. Um, I watched, so I watched episode one and two of The Mandalorian because uh, episode, episode two dropped today. Uh, this morning and then third episode drops next Friday and so on and so forth 
Um, the funny thing is I actually started uh, Disney Plus by watching, uh, well, after I watched The Mandalorian, I was watching a lot of the original Spider-Man TV show. Because I've been wanting to watch like Spider-Man Unlimited and Spider-Man, Ultimate Spider-Man and all those TVs, uh, TV shows, so. Where'd he go? There's something right here that he wanted to see. I'll there check it, it out. Oh, it's the, the tunnels. Oh, she's over there. Hey, you are? It's cool to see the clone's perspective about the military. Yeah, I really want to watch it again. You about BD1. Come on board. Clone Wars is inside. between two and three, right? Episodes two oh, and three. BD1, this is Grease. Hey, and Grace. then three happens. What is that? And then, get off yeah. my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! No! Get out of there! Get out! I can't wait that to watch all the BD1. movies again, too. With us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea Since how Since they're upscaled to, to 4K on Disney+. Plus. Not really. Oh. I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of Force-sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! I hope oh, Cordova, we see cool. somebody... Even yeah. if it's like the slightest yes. thing. A long time ago, I was in the apprentice. movies or something. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, mm -hmm. but only accessible Data holocrons. to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Sick. Use the force. Holocrons are so cool. I, I actually loved finding them in uh, SWOTOR. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. Yo. With that list of Force Sensitives, Sick. we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault and to get yeah, it, we have to follow sick. Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zeppo homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. <laughs> Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. What do you How need? How you're no longer a Jedi? I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. How do you even do that? I rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the order is the best chance we have against the Empire. So why doesn't what do she restore her connection with the Force? I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? Or against us? I mean... We're in. Obviously. It's your choice. 